Hey guys, Craig here at DLX. Today we're gonna to go over how to replace and install a new main control board in your Lux X marker. The tools you'll need for this is your 5 64th Allen wrench and your 1 16th Allen wrench. Before you begin, you first wanna make sure the marker is safe and degas. Remove your bolt kit from the marker and also unscrew your barrel. Next, you wanna move your frame by pushing forward on your rear latch until you hear the audible click and pushing down on your front latch until you hear it click and separate the frame and the body. The reason we remove the frame is to prevent damage from the solenoid to board connection during re-insulation. Next, we're gonna get your Lux X frame prepared for the board removal and install process. You wanna first remove your grips from the left side by pulling up on your snap screws. And then turning it over and using your 564th Allen wrench, removing your two grip screws. Once those are removed, go ahead and remove your grips. Next, you will want to remove your red battery tab. Push up on your battery and remove your battery from your frame. We're gonna go ahead and remove your trigger using a 1 16th Allen wrench and removing your trigger pin. First step of the board removal process is to go ahead and carefully disconnect your eye-wire harness from the circuit board. Once disconnected, I'm going to use the two red tabs located here and here on your, on your board and rotate those to line up with the main circuit board cuts. Once they are aligned, I'm going to go ahead and rotate your frame and carefully push forward to remove your circuit board from your frame. And also, your OLED screen will usually come out during the same time, or it may need removed by carefully removing it from the cutout section in the frame. Prior to installation, you wanna go ahead and familiarize yourself with the OLED screen and the main board and the certain components and how they line up for proper fit. First, you wanna look at the pins on the OLED screen and make sure that they line up with this connector on the main board. Next, we're gonna look at the two pins for the power connection of the main board and make sure that they fit and align into the slot cut in the frame. First, you wanna install your screen, making sure that your OLED screen cuts line up with the cuts inside the frame. Once aligned and installed properly, you want to take your main board and carefully align it, making sure that your pins are all lined up that we just mentioned. Gently press it into place. Next, you want to rotate your red tabs to lock the board into place, like so. And lastly, you want to plug back in your eye wire. 